Okay, hey YouTube. Um, I'm just gonna kind of talk to you about how to um, make your display kind of like really pop out. You know, make it seem really wow and kind of enhance your colours and everything. So, have a quick look at my current displays. You know, they look all right. They're on their default settings. Right. Okay. I'm gonna show you how to do this on an Nvidia card. So, um, what you have to do is you go to Video control panel, and then click on adjust desktop color settings here, <clears throat> and you should get an option down here for digital vibrance. Now that it's the default setting is 50%, and you can just literally push that bar up as much as you want. So watch this now, and I'm going to up it. Okay, there's like a a huge burst of color, <clears throat> and now if you look again. You know, it looks really good now. And this, um, it'll make all the videos you watch online look better. It'll <coughs> make your games look better. Everything you do on your computer will look pretty awesome. <coughs> you know, even if you've got like a, you know, a crappy monitor like I do, they're not brilliant monitors on their own, but once you sort of push the colors up, it looks, starts to look really good. Um, the second thing you can do is here. It gives you the option to choose how color is set. So if we use the NVIDIA settings here, and now we crank up the contrast, so watch this, you suddenly get deeper darks and kind of lighter lights, and it makes it look more kind of realistic and gives it that kind of wow factor. And I mean, you might want to turn both down, so you might want to put contrast on maybe 85 and vibrance on maybe 85 as well. And maybe that's how you want it to look, which is cool. Um, personally, I keep my vibrance on 95 and contrast on 85. <clears throat> and I find that works fine. Um, so, I mean, I'll show you a couple of wallpapers with um, these settings on. Some people might not like the contrast too high, but I mean, personally, it's, it's cool with me. This is a pretty awesome one. one. So yeah, hope that helps. Um, generally, don't try and adjust your colour settings from your actual monitor, because if you've not got a good monitor, then normally they just don't work, they just make it worse, and your contrast just makes everything look brighter. So I wouldn't really bother with that, to be honest. If you're going to do it, do it through your NVIDIA or ATI control panel. Thing with If you've got an ATI card, what you can do is um, go to your Catalyst Control Center and adjust saturation. They probably have an option for contrast there as well, but definitely use the saturation because that, that enhances colours. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Rate, subscribe, comment, like.